Thousand farmers on the Copper Belt province have so far collected their inputs under the Farmer Input Support Program (FISIP) for the 2021-2022 farming season. Copper Belt Provincial Agriculture Coordinator Obvious Kabinda says this translates into about 37 percent of the 107,000 farmers under FISIP in the province. Nais reports that he said this when Nyimba Investment Head of Sales and Marketing, Wellings Mulendema, visited him at his office in Indola after touring some districts to check the progress in issuance of FISIP fertilizer to farmers. We have details in the following report. So if you know Issuance of inputs to farmers on the Copper Belt province is on course. About 40,000 farmers under the Farmer Input Support Program, FACIP, in the province have so far collected their inputs. As by yesterday, 17 hours, the whole province so far could say 37% corrected. But issued the authority to correct, we are about 48%. Kai, the issue, then maybe people collect today, the others will collect the following day. To me, the end of this month, we shall be done on the ground. The fertilizer supplier Nimba Investments is targeting to complete the issuance of inputs to farmers in the province by end of November. So far, um, I think Copper Belt province allocation is 32,550. Yes. Combined top dressing and, uh, and basil. Uh, and as, as of yesterday, I think Copper Belt province has redeemed and issued to the farmers 10,000 tons. Yes, yes. So which is giving us a percentage of roughly 31% percent done yeah. in the last two weeks. Okay. So with the same speed, if the farmers can keep the same uptake speed, yes. mm -hmm. we expect that by the end of this month, I think a lot of um, districts in Copper Belt should be complete. Okay. To farmers in the province, the distribution of inputs is in good time for planting. I am Nicholas Mare reporting in Dollar. Vice President W.K. Mutelena Lumango has assured women that government will